After three long years of waiting, we have finally gotten what we deserved. A Mexican legend. Drum roll! <laughs> Luis El Matador Hernandez. His rating was revealed a few days ago alongside with another new legends, including the god Puyo with 90 overall. But we're not talking about him, we're talking about Luis El Hernandez. We're talking about him. The God El Matador. Ooh, me gusta. His rating is 87. The stats that stand out the most is 90, his 92 pace his 87 shooting and his 87 dribbling and not to forget the 4 star skill moves in my opinion I wasn't expecting this player to be uh, have a legend card this early on because I wanted people like I don't say I didn't want people like I was expecting people like Jorge Campos, Hugo Sanchez, Guatemala Blanco, Hugo Sanchez and the other freaking god legends in Mexico to have a legend card but sadly we have with this but not sadly because it's fantastic. I'm not complaining at all. We have a Mexican legend in FIFA 17. I play PS4, so I can't get him. Um, picking in Matador was uh, as a first choice uh, for Mexican legend, the first Mexican legend in FIFA 17, or just in the FIFA series in total. It's a good start, actually. It's a good start. I like it. I like it. And we can only hope for more of these Mexican legends in FIFA 18 or even in the future, you never know. Hope you enjoyed this video, I know it's kind of short. It was just gonna a little review reveal of Luis and Mateo de Nenes, because I'm pumped. I am actually are. But sadly, like I said, I play PS4, so... Oh y'all, Xbox freaking lucky fan fanboys. Congratulations, you have a Mexican legend in FIFA 17. I'll see you in the next one.